what is the difference between EDI and ALE? Pretty standard question. And you should have pretty standard answers too. Right? EDI is basically cross-platform. And when I mean platform, I'm not talking about your operating system or database or stuff like that. When I mean cross-platform, it is across clients. It's a common message that everybody shares and understands. It's a common language. Or rather, you can call it same language. ALE is not cross-platform. It is restricted. It is basically within SAP system. Or I'm not saying it is within one system. It's across systems. It could be across systems, but... The source and the recipient system has to be SAP. So I can put it as within SAP systems, right? So this is typically used for transactional data. This is mostly used for master data. That's not to say that master data distribution cannot be used with EDI or transactional data cannot be used with ALE. But this is typically the way the usage goes in the industry. Another example is to, to do EDI, you need a subsystem that understands EDI. To do ALE, you don't need a subsystem. SAP can directly interact with another EDI system or I mean SAP can directly interact with another SAP system without the need for a subsystem. There is no need for translation because the target system is SAP as well. So the key is if both the systems are SAP, you can use ALE. But that's rarely the case, right? Except within the company where you have control. You can dictate what your vendor has. You can dictate what your customer has. You can dictate what your bank has. So that's the reason why EDI is used. EDI is actually more complicated, meaning there are more moving parts like subsystem, translation happens. There are so many things that happen. But ELE is a simple system, meaning, you know, it's all transactional and a master data, IDOC, for example, can move from system A to system B seamlessly without the need for a huge subsystem. But with EDI, it's complicated because there is translations involved. And when I mean translation, from the IDOC to a standard format, like a text file. But there's no need for translations here. So basically, ALA is a much simpler system.